Thanks for tuning in. Today we're going to be reviewing the Lizard Skins Monitor 3 Season Cycling Gloves. As a cyclist, your hands are one of the most exposed parts of your body. Not only are they directly in the wind, but they also have the important task of braking and gear changes. The Lizard Skin 3 Season Gloves are designed to keep your hands warm and maintain your dexterity even during shoulder season or colder weather. As you can see here, packaging wise, it comes in with a little plastic sleeve. And then the gloves mounted by just a little zip tie onto a cardboard backing. You have a little paper thing to hold it together and otherwise pretty nice and simple. We'll go ahead and take this out and go over the specs. Retail price on this is $39.99, so pretty affordable. And with this, these are three season gloves and three season really depends on where you live, of course. They, are, they have an elastic wrist cuff, which is pretty nice. So you can see on the edge, it's a like elastic instead of a tab. You have a one piece palm with this nice textured finish for extra grip. And you also have a fleece backing material for insulation on the back side. So definitely a nice mid-weight glove for cycling. In terms of what comes with it, obviously you just get the two gloves and that's about it. Now let's take a look at the weight of the gloves. These are the large variation. So together they come in at 76 grams. Lizard Skin has developed the Monitor 3 Season Gloves as a 3 season glove that gives you wind and water resistance in a mid-weight style glove. So you can definitely wear this where a winter glove might be too heavy and a summer glove might be too cold. It's only offered in a single black color. So you can see it's mostly black. You have Lizard Skin on the side in this nice reflective finish, which gives you a little bit of nighttime visibility, but otherwise very minimal design, no real graphics. On the cuff, you can see it's an elastic design. So instead of having a Velcro tab, you just pull this back, put it on, and you can see it's pretty nice. Makes it a lot easier and you don't have the Velcro coming loose mid-ride. Yet it's still tight enough, so you do have nice closure around your wrist. You can see the backing on here has a fleece lining, so it's a flexible fleece. So pretty lightweight, but it still gives you some insulation. And then you have the nose rag part with this different material here. So it's a little bit softer and easier to use on your nose. The palm is probably the more interesting part of this. So you can see it's actually one piece and it has this interesting dot pattern on here. These aren't perforations. They're just for non-slip, so they don't actually go all the way through. And you can see it extends all the way from the wrist to each finger. So a lot of flexibility and no seams on the inside to cause any discomfort. So a pretty sleek design and they're about mid-weight, so not too heavy with some decent insulation. Here you see the gloves in natural lighting. They're very comfortable. This is the large size and they fit very similar to other brands we've worn. Great articulation with that one piece palm. You don't really have any seams or any discomfort on the inside. We also appreciate that elastic cuff. As you can see, it's very comfortable. You don't have any Velcro straps that come loose mid-ride. Also, the texture on there is very nice, it's grippy. The one downside of this design is that it's not really touchscreen compatible. You can see here it sort of works, but it's very much hit or miss. Now, as far as riding with this, it may be called a three-season glove, but it's probably more of a shoulder-season glove. So we found it to be comfortable between 40 and 60 degrees. It really depends on your personal preference. We have very cold hands, so we usually wear long sleeve gloves for most of the year. But if you have warmer hands, you could definitely wear this in colder weather. Now, they're not really a winter glove or a rain glove, so you do have to ride appropriately. But if you're in kind of a mixed temperature and you don't want a thick winter glove, it's a great option. And as with the handlebar grips, they're very comfortable and grippy. So really no complaints there. Even with sort of wet handlebars, they perform very well. And with that one piece palm, again, really nice and grippy and no real seam to cause any discomfort. Now let's compare the Lizard Skin Monitor 3 Season and other gloves on the market. Here we have one of Pox lightweight summer gloves. You can see this is actually perforated, so these are see-through holes. So it's a very thin, lightweight summer glove. It simply protects you from the elements, but doesn't have any insulation. Compare that to the Lizard Skin, it's a lot warmer than this, and you actually have some thermal backing, while a true summer glove wouldn't have that. There's also a lot of gel variations of gloves. So these are some Pearl Azumi gloves we have. You can see it has padding on the interior of the palm. It gives you a little bit more padding on the handlebars versus the simple flat construction of the lizard skin. But again, it's very lightweight, thin, and it's just simply perforated and doesn't really have any thermal protection. 
when the weather really starts getting cold, you want a winter glove. This is one of our craft gloves. You can see quite a bit thicker, and even if you peek on the inside, you can see thick fleece interior lining for insulation, but quite a bit bulkier. So you can see it looks more like a almost skiing glove versus the lizard skin, which is more form fitting. So with the lizard skin, you get a nice glove that fits in between more of a true winter glove and a lightweight summer glove. Now let's go over the pros and cons for the Lizard Skins three season glove. What we like about them is that they have an affordable price point. And they also have a one piece palm, which is really comfortable and quite grippy, just like the Lizard Skin handlebar grips. They also have reflective logos on the side for additional nighttime visibility. The main negatives for these gloves is the fact that they're only offered in black. It'd be nice to have more colors and graphic options. And they're not really touchscreen compatible, so it's very hit or miss with GPS computers or your phone. Taking everything into account would give the three season gloves a 9.6 out of 10. These are perfect in between weather gloves. They're not too heavy and they still have some warmth to them. Thanks for watching this review. Don't forget to like and subscribe. You can see more content from us on our website at thesweetcyclist.com as well as follow us on Instagram at thesweetcyclist. This is The Sweet Cyclist reminding you to enjoy the ride.